Okay, guys, we are back. We are at the Tangent, and I'm having a great time meeting beautiful people. Creative artists are all around. I mean, they're oozing out the woodworks here now. Um, I just snagged the good one here. I got a nice gym. Her name's Kelly. Hi, Kelly. Hi, how are you? I am dandy and full of candy tonight. <laughs> I love her art because it is, you see the shine? Do anyone know what that is? One, two, three. Anyone know? This is resin, and she got sprinkles of glitter in it. I love the resin. It's very um, sophisticated now, if you ask me. I love how it's, it's like a high quality varnish that we use now. And it wasn't as popular, you know, on canvases like 10 years ago. But enough about that. <laughs> what kind of art do you do, Kelly? Tell the people what you do. Um, so basically what I do is I uh, consider myself a collage artist. Collage uh, and craft, they're typically things that are deemed fem or women's work and not often seen as art, more deemed as craft. So what I like to do is poke fun and push the barriers of what exactly is craft and what is fine art. And how, and, and how do you think you've done that, creating this beautiful art? These look like pictures. Yeah, so um, a lot of my uh, experience, negative experiences of being a woman come from being online and dealing with anonymous, misogynistic people. Uh, so that's kind of where the digital imagery comes from. And I think instead of using traditional paper cutting methods, I do a, a digital collage. But then I like to uh, make it shiny and sparkly and pretty. So people at first see it as a very beautiful piece, but once they start looking in at the details, it becomes a little more unsettling. It literally draws you in. You think you're looking at a picture of something, and then you think that she painted it. But then it looks like, you, you don't know, like a sticker from Fat Boy. But then you get up close, <laughs> when you get up close, you see this beautiful creativity where you can tell this is digital, but then she kind of contoured it and contoured it the way she wanted. And, and if you look at this negative space of a pattern, it's beautiful. It's amazing. And there's creepy details in the background, like you can see bone chandeliers and things like that. I love it. I love it. It's amazing. And um, it's a lot to look at. You can, I can look at this three times and probably won't see something I didn't see the last time. You know what I'm saying? I love collage pieces. And we have another piece right here too. I'm a, I'm a big fan of Kelly's now. Look at this right here. This is amazing, Samson. Do you see this? This one, the, I think this devour, devour to Survive. And are those day lilies in that picture? Yes, they are. So lilies are often used as a representation of femininity. You also see them a lot in Catholicism as symbolizing the Virgin Mary. So I like to kind of use those hyper feminist or feminine imagery in my pieces. Your pieces are totally appropriate and they fit the whole uh, prominence of this exhibition, you know, it's women uprising and, you know, it's the, visa, the Venus and it represents the women and empowerment. So, you know, it's girl power all over the place, guys. We are doing an amazing job here and Kelly's awesome, right? <laughs> all right. And let me ask you this. If someone wanted to buy your art or even wanted to see your art, how could they see it or how could they find you, contact you? Well, you can find me on Facebook at Kelly J Art. You can also go to Kelly J, just the letter, art.com, and that's where you'll find my artwork there as well. But Facebook tends to be the most easy way to get a hold of me. Uh, you can also find me on Instagram too. It's Kelly J A Y Art. That's my username. All right, now, well, thank you so much, Kelly, for your time. I have met so many cool people here tonight. Kelly is one of them. I love coming to the Tangent. This is my second time doing um, this event. And um, this is the second, the first time I was able to do interviews here. Such a treat tonight. So I um, hope you guys enjoy watching the show. And we'll be back soon.